Hello and welcome to Everything to Guppy, the podcast where we talk about every single item, every single enemy, every single everything in the Binding of Isaac. I'm William Hughes, and I'm joined, as always, by a guy with uh, a good taste in azure headgear, Gary Butterfield. My lady. Yeah, um, yeah, I love it. I love it. Yep. We're getting super into MRA pickup shit this week. Mm-hmm. I, was, I, I read this thing called The Method. Ooh, see, I'm more of, of the game. Ooh. Well, they're, they're very similar, but they're two distinct schools of thought. Yeah, and, and the, different copyrights, which is different the Different copyrights, thing. different ISBNs, you know, so it's got that That's going tr- for it. Hey, way to bust out ISBN professional author Gary Butterfield. <laughs> Thank you. I guess that is technically true. Anybody want a copy of Atomic? <laughs> I've got hundreds. <laughs> um, <laughs> the, uh, I'll take another. Oh, yeah, sure. You can race them. Um, <laughs> like, it is, of course, uh, my landlord's mowing my lawn week on everything to guppy. Yeah. We decided to so, go for a less esoteric theme, something more concrete. Yeah, yeah something relatable. Mm-hmm. Uh, my yeah. landlord, who I did pay the rent to, uh, we'll see how long that holds up. Mm-hmm. I, I put off Don't let li- Jeremy, rent. don't listen. Jeremy, I, don't I, listen. I wanted to make my landlord sweat a little bit because they've sure. been putting up all these signs, you Ooh. know, about, about rent. And I was like, I'm going to pay, pay in the last possible day. Before I get a fee, just to make you guys panic a little bit, because I don't. Like I mean, I always words. do that just because I'm an irresponsible human being. I, I forget a lot of the time too. I forgot once, and they charged me money, and I'm like, "That's dumb." It's like one day late. Like it, that's purely punitive. Like it didn't cost you anything. That's just a punishment, you know. And you just got slightly more money for me making a mistake. Yeah, that seem I mean, fair. welcome to you know American capitalism, Gary. It's fucked up. Doesn't Fuck it, like, red strike. I'm going to go get my check back. Yeah, do it. <laughs> like push them off the lawnmower. I got there. Um, <laughs> yeah, just got there. Hey, Jeremy. <laughs> Oof. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I assumed there's a riding lawn more. I know you have a small, yeah, like I know your lawn. It's so. true. I, th- I, I've never actually seen it because it's on the other side of a fence Ooh, right now. It's like a, I bet it's home a improvement. Pusher. Yeah. Um, you can go out there and be like, Jeremy, I'm having trouble with my wife. Ding, 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 ding. Boom, ding, ding. <laughs> you could do that. That's good, Gary. That's. Maybe Thank that's you. what should we do now instead of this podcast? <laughs> just, yeah. just the noises? Yeah, just the home improvement noises as a podcast. <laughs> could, the Poison Ball podcast. Like every Is there week a we podcast just that's just new... noises? Just noises? I, th- I think you could argue that a certain podcast called Everything to Guppy qualifies as mostly just noises. I get that that's uh, a good joke, but I'm serious. Just a <laughs> podcast that's just noises. Like sound effects. Yeah. I know there's uh, – uh, for a while someone was putting out a podcast of just their cat purring. For like a, half an hour. That's nice. It was it was nice to listen to. Yeah, that sounds awesome. Yeah. Um, I would love a, like a Halloween sound effects podcast. Ooh, like yeah. I can't believe Evan Schletter hasn't done that already. Yeah, that, that's only a real Evan Schletter. I love I love when the talented get to hang out with the funny. Yeah, you know, like <laughs> just like you know, I get to hang out with all these comedy geniuses because I just happen to be like a pretty good musician. Yeah, you know. No, oh. uh, we're talking about Blue Cap today. We are. Uh, a great we're item. still we're still in like kind of boring. We're in another run of semi boring boss item. It's boring, but this is really good. It is. Like uh, I, I Gary, always happy me, to see it. Gary, walk me through what what's going on here. Well, give us the a, guppy tour. You get a full red heart. Well, wait, wait, wait. Let's start at the beginning of the tour. Oh, thank you. It's a blue mushroom. Nice. The implication is it's psychedelic. Uh that's certainly the implication. That's yes. the implication. That is. Implication. Does that still hold up? That bit, that uh, always sunny bit, or is that too I, rough now? I I think that those guys. I give them a pass for a lot of stuff, other than like the transphobia shit. Yeah, from the early seasons. I think the implication thing is pretty funny. I think Dennis Reynolds is a really funny character. Agree. I'm it, glad that we, as two horrendous. white men, have. Yeah, yeah. We passed, we decided past appropriate judgment. We gave them the white guy pass. Yeah, me, Will Hughes, and Danny DeVito agree that Dennis Reynolds is a funny character. Man, didn't Dan DeVito would kill on this show, man. Dan, we could have Dan, yeah. I get Dan, we, yeah. Gary, uh, not to dip into content we might be talking about later this week, we really need to start bringing Cameo more into this show. Yeah, what is that? Uh, oh, Cameo is the thing you use to record those Tony Ricca clips uh, you made me put at the start of all the episodes last week. Oh, I mean, well, that's what you think. Oh, okay. But really, I've been working on this character, Will. <laughs> okay, I forgot. Yeah. Gary's uh, amazing character work. He'll, uh, yeah, well, I mean, you get a lot of the character credit on this show. And I just felt like creating a, a fully developed persona. Yeah, like a lived in, really weird WWE, maybe 
wrestler yeah. who's also the cannoli king of New Jersey. Yeah, because I, I've always wanted to be the cannoli king of something. And Gary, I've always believed that you could be, provided you picked a small enough space. Yeah, and New Jersey seems big, but actually it's rather quite small. I mean, it's the Garden State. Gardens ain't big. It, 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 there you go. There <laughs> Thank you, go. you. <laughs> Gary. <laughs> Thank you. Was there Thank a little you, burst Will. of logic happening in your head for a second there before you decided to agree? <laughs> <laughs> I was just checking it through the old fact checker. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, uh, yo, yo, yo. Uh, after you get the heart container, you get uh, tears up, and it's a significant tears up. Yeah. Uh, yo. And then the I think the psychedelic part is that your shot speed goes down because you're like tripping. Which is fine. Shot speed doesn't matter unless an enemy is moving around a lot. Yeah. And it doesn't Which go, most it enemies doesn't, in this game don't. It doesn't go down very much either. So getting any of those two for one stat ups are really nice. Yeah. Even if one of those stats is health. Yeah. And health, you know, health is fine. You know, early on you want his fuel for deal with the devil. Like this is like you picked up the wire coat hanger and you got a one heart deal with the devil item. Yeah. You know, later. Later. Yeah. In time. In time, Set which... In time. People think it's a river, but it's actually an ocean in a storm. Prince of Persia, Sands of Time. Ooh, is that what we're talking about this week? That was what I was talking about this week. No, nah, that's what we're talking about now. Welcome to Watch Out for Fireballs. I'm Cole Ross. I'm the other one. <laughs> and you're listening to Watch Out for Fireballs. It's Yeah, but like on a cute ukulele or some shit like that. Yeah, like just like... Hey, it's Gary Butterfield. <laughs> that actually is, is the Wire Star for Fireball theme. <laughs> That's pretty video killed the radio star. Hey, man. <laughs> I heard yeah. you on the wireless back in. Watch out for fireballs. I guess it is pretty good. Video- it sounds less like video killed the radio <laughs> star on a keyboard. Yeah. Gary, are there, you know, there's lyrics to the Star Trek theme. Are there lyrics to the WAF theme? Yeah. Are there? Yeah, they're my mom's last words, so I don't tell anybody. <laughs> ah, and the rough chuckles continue. Um, yeah, yeah, as far as boss room items go, uh, this is fine. It's good. It's on the good side. It's. I think it's a, It's one of the better ones. Um, but part of that is the guppy curve, because early on, I was like, when I was first playing the Flash version, I was like, oh, meat, 0.3 damage up and health up. That's the best it's ever going to be. Yeah, you know? what, a, what a beautiful dream. So any of these like kind of multitasking ones really go for it for me. Have you ever done a psychedelic mushroom, Will? Gary, you know the answer to that is no. I do. Do you have any interest? Uh, not especially. Like, there was definitely a period uh, when I was like 26 and was reading too many Grant Morrison comics where I was like, I should do LSD. Uh, yeah. But then, Gary, you know what happened? Why? Well, what happened? I, di- I didn't. Oh. <laughs> Seems scary. And ever since I didn't, I never did again. <laughs> the winning um, news story. <laughs> um, I am very scared of LSD. But enough people. Sure, because you're worried about, about being insane forever? Yeah. Or just having, because it lasts forever. Like it lasts for like eight hours. Yeah. I'm scared of anything that lasts eight hours. Gary, let's like, just do salvia. Fuck it. Well, I was thinking, like, people have told me that magic mushrooms are really relaxing. And I really seek a relaxing drug. Sure. Like I nowadays. mean, that's heroin, buddy. Yeah, I know. But I don't want to die. Like, heroin's, I want I want to. Gary, heroin's yeah. super relaxing. No, no. But I don't want to die. I'm trying not to die. Okay. I don't but wanna, just don't do too much. I guess that's true. Yeah. I, I, I told you before about the guy in my high school who told uh, me with a straight face, cocaine is an addictive. I do it every day. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. I don't think it was a, a joke. I don't think he was doing it as a joke. I think he's trying to convince me. That actually like, feels like something and it's always sunny character would say. Totally. Yeah, exactly. Like I was like a little dare nerd. So I was probably like trying to talk this older kid out of doing drugs. Uh, so Gary, were you a narc? No. Okay. If I was a narc, my parent, like I would have been raised in foster. Yeah. Uh, Cause <laughs> <laughs> like I, I had, I had a very uh, specific interest in not being a narc. So, oh man. So, so uh, listeners, if you think Gary should start a heroin habit, Mm-hmm. Uh, let us know. Mm-hmm. And maybe you know not expensive. in the, maybe not in the Apple reviews. No, no, no. And and maybe not through text or telling me. Maybe think it. Yeah, think it hard. Maybe think it real hard at Gary while I'm sleeping. In fact, anytime you want Gary to know anything, mm-hmm. 
maybe start with a good couple months of thinking it at him. Yeah. And then, and then also like when I'm sleeping and even if you want me to do anything, do that. Like just really hard. And I promise I'll hear it yeah, in my Gary sleep. will hear it. I'll hear it. Um, but if you want Gary to really know what you're thinking, mm, give us some money. Yeah. You can, you can write it in a Patreon message and I'll read it and respond with a svelte thumbs up emoji. Um, only svelte thing about him. <laughs> <laughs> my dick's rather thin. Um, what's that Gary? <laughs> nothing. Uh, if you go to, uh, patreon.com slash duck PTV, give us money. You can also leave us a rating review on Apple podcast. Like. Yeah. Uh, like this one from all these nicknames have been taken. Uh, five star review. Thank you. Misleading description. Oh, did I already do this one? I think I'm already done this one. <laughs> I, don't I don't care. It's okay, I guess, but they really don't talk about Ace of Base that much at all. All right. Thank you. I don't know if you did that one or not. I don't know either. Is there an Ace of Base song called Guppy or something? I think there's, there's an Ace of Base song called Everything to Guppy. Is there I, literally no, that? I don't think so. That'd be amazing, though. We definitely didn't Google before we made the show, so. No, 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 no. I Googled Binding of Isaac podcast, and there's not one. So. Uh, and there still isn't. Good night. Yep, cats. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> the famous sign-off, cats. Cats. <laughs>